majority of us that we have failed IVF procedure pretend as if that won't be a problem. Professionals will give you an advice, but some of you, you believe that your faith will see you through. And when that faith failed to see you through, you still go back to God and start asking God, God, why? Because religion has blindfolded some of us. Look at this video. If you are age 36 and above, and your hair image is very good, have a donor backup program to that procedure. Okay. This video is talking about do not use your head when your head is around 36 years and above. No problem. You believe God will see you too. God is omnipotent. I believe too. You go ahead against professional advice. You use your head. During the stimulation protocols, they said they do not find so many eggs inside you. What are you expecting that result to look like? Please, let us separate faith from the reality and science. I know some of you will come to under this comment session now. I'm not a Christian. I don't believe in God. And that's really cool. And you see some, they, yes. But go and ask those people who have done IVF with their heads and in fields, and they still go back and go and ask the professional. Why? <laughs> That means you are pretending as if you don't know where the problem is coming from. That to do a procedure in a particular center and in phase, does not mean the center is not good. Other people take the recommendation that you refused to take and they get results. Go and look at the video full on this platform. Then take all the recommendations. I've given out a lot of information about fertility. Some people are taking it, some are not taking it. Some match faith with science and reality. And I'm telling you at times, they can't be missed. There's a difference, a gap between a science and faith. Yes, when science is being defeated by reality, that is what we call miracle. God will help us. My name is Wojo Adeke in this summer. I'm a practicing fertility scientist in Ikeja, Lagos State, Nigeria. Till I come your way next time. God is good. Bye.